Hey there, AP Bio Cohort C, Digital Learning Academy students. Um, for your experimental design uh, lab this week, something that you can easily do at home, and that is germinating mustard seeds. We've done this in class before. Um, it, it's, it's a good one. And uh, I'm just going to scroll down. You can download this off of off of Schoology, and I'm just going to go to the instructions and stuff. Um, and this is your experimental design. You're going to set up two uh, situations. You're going to have the control situation, and you're going to have uh, uh, the experiment uh, dish, essentially. And you can read about germination and, and seed stuff. You don't have to be an official botanist to understand what's going on. You're just going to do a little background reading. And then what you're going to germinate is mustard seeds. Uh, and mustard seed is very easy. I'm going to almost guarantee that if you go in your parents' uh, uh, pantry into their, um, where the spices and stuff are, they may have a jar of mustard seed. That's all it is, or a little packet of mustard seed. It's, it's often used. Uh, in spice and you can grind it up, make your own mustard, blah, 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 whatever. Um, and I'll say that it, as this is the first one and, uh, and you know, uh, if I've forgotten to say this during our uh, Zoom uh, classroom and stuff like that, all the experiments that we want you to do, if I can send stuff home uh, that's safe, I will, but that's going to make some difficulty and getting packets home or students picking up or whatever. So I'm trying to design a comparable lab for you uh, that will do that will give you the same learning that we're doing in class. We're doing something with sodium alginate and calcium chloride, which really um, I need to mix up some stuff with and it's not really safe to send home. I mean, I suppose you could, but yeah. Anyhow, mustard seed's very easy. Most people have it. You'll have to do the same thing, learn the same concepts and stuff. So mustard seed should be in a cabinet. If it is not in the cabinet, and again, I don't want you going on and spend millions of dollars trying to do at-home labs. That's why we're trying to do activities in labs that will uh, be easy to find stuff in your kitchen. Um, and mustard seeds aren't that, you know, it's a spice. It's not that expensive, but you don't have to get it. If, if possible, and if it's a trouble it, problem getting mustard seeds, just kind of tell you, I have plenty in the classroom here that we've used when we've done this lab in class and we can maybe set up a pickup time. Anyhow, it's very simple. As you can see in the instructions, get a couple of Petri dishes and filter papers. Well, you're not here. So what I said is a couple of small dishes, a couple of small plates, bowls, whatever, little tiny things, uh, something to just uh, retain the seeds in the water, whatever, and some paper towel, napkins, something like that. And really what you're going to put is 10 to 20 seeds in each dish, equal number. You're going to moisten the, the paper with enough water so that the seeds just barely begin to float. Okay. Um, and then you're going to decide one dish gets set aside, and that's your control dish. The other dish is whatever you're doing to maybe uh, speed up, I believe, is what we're supposed to do, but alter the germination rate. Okay. All right. And then for five days, you just sit and collect and fill data. To, you can see fill in the data table of how many germinate. And then there'll be some analysis and stuff to do that, but that's it. Some mustard seed, some water, some paper towel, let things flow a little bit, decide what you're gonna do to try and change the germination rate, and then just check your data every day, okay? Um, and that's really the concept for the week. We will get that going and later in the week, we'll maybe talk about the analysis and what you need to do, but it's gonna take you five days to do this. so. Um, no rush. Again, we haven't really set dates yet in AP Bio as to when things are going because I'm trying to figure out how we can utilize Wednesdays and stuff so we can we can get in the full curriculum. All right. If you have any questions, you can talk to me during office hours, or you know, probably just in class right now uh, when we when we have our class session, uh, we can have that discussion. 
Um, but either way, we'll find a way. So have fun germinating and making your own little mustard plants. And we will talk with you again soon.